I may have a special surprise for you. Really? Yeah. So, our second guest? I want you to close your eyes right now because I hear them. All right. Come on in. Hi. Oh, hey, buddy. Hi, friend. How are you? I'm doing okay. Oh, good. Yeah, what's going on? <laughs> I may have a special surprise for you. Really? Yeah. So, our second guest? Maybe. Be honest, do you know who it is? I had ideas. Okay. Uh, and I, was, I, I can't lie to you, I have been thinking about it. Cause you, the I one shouldn't thing have told that, you at all. Yeah, the one thing that stands out is they are like they're doing us a favor. Mm -hmm. So I'm like, who could that be? It's got to be someone like doing fairly well in the comedy scene or a music scene or they're just, pretty cool. They're pretty cool. There, so there, two more than one, or one person. Well, I can one. refer to people as they. Okay, so uh, there. He or she is pretty cool. Um, can I guess? You can guess now if you'd like. But I thought it was maybe Kalila. Okay. Uh, Esther Pavitsky, maybe. Okay. And I thought Whitney Cummings, but no, because that's kind of there's no way because she hasn't. She's kind of kind of gone cold <laughs> with the adoption thing. Right. Um, Eric Gri Griffin? These are all good guesses. We'll see. We'll see in a second. So, obviously, I'm wrong because you would have been like, okay, you guessed right. Why would I Why do I tell you th that you were right before the, the guess would come out? Okay, now I'm getting antsy, and I can't wait to see who the guest is. Are they near? They might be near. I want you to close your eyes. Okay, right now? I want you to close your eyes right now because I hear them. Okay? okay? Close okay. your eyes, Steve. Okay. All right. Come on in. Steve's got his eyes closed. <laughs> All right, Steve. When? Right now? Open your eyes. Hi. Hi. What's going on? What's up? This is my sister, Steve. <laughs> I told you you were never going to guess. I didn't even know you had a sister. <laughs> exactly, dude. I haven't said anything about her purposely planning up to this very moment. You got to be kidding me. That you're are, are you really related to him? I am. Is, I am. This is you. you this is my blood sister. This is my younger sister. This is Janessa. Meet Steve. Hi, uh, nice to so meet nice you. So nice to meet you. So I'm, nice a, to I'm a fan of the Watkins. I'm a huge fan. I of love you. your mom. Um, oh. Your mom is a very nice woman. Yeah. I did not know you even had a brother or sister. Yeah. Are you sure? What do you mean? Am I sure this if this is, is your, my sister? This is your what do you mean? What do you mean? Am I sure this if this is, is your my sister? sister? Yeah, Steve. This is my sister. She flew in from Kansas to see the baby. Oh my God. And you. This is crazy. She's actually I'm, I'm a huge fan. I'm a scissor sister. Really? Yes. Mm. So do you like what we're doing? I love it. Yeah. Apart from the mom episode. It was, oh, the mom it, one. That was a what little much. What do you not like about that? All of it. It was... Because she was hitting on me pretty it hard. Was, it was slightly uncomfortable. She wanted to wrestle me. She did. Yeah. I'm this sorry is your about sister? that. Yes, this is my sister. Wait, you look at me like you guys both look at me. I want to see. <laughs> my nose isn't big enough, is it? All right. All right. We don't look anything alike, Steve. No. We don't. We're we... actually fraternal twins. <laughs> no, we're not. <laughs> is it just you two? I've got. Well, should I tell you or should I bring out my brother? No, oh. my brother. My old, I have an is older it just brother. You two? I have an older brother. We have one more. Yeah, he's not here though. To be honest, he's not here. She's the oldest. My no, my brother's the, middle. the oldest. Yeah, I'm in the middle. And she's the baby. I'm the baby. Yeah, she's the baby. So two boys and a girl. That is how the family. Wow. Came so to be. I have some questions. Oh okay. really? What was it like? 
growing up in the same household <gasps> as Jeremiah? Was he nice to you? Was he a bully? They were definitely bullies. A little bit. A little bit. I mean, I was kind of a little shit. I, I'll admit that. Mm-hmm. But no, they they were bullies. Did you, I, I endured yeah. a lot of psychological pain. Were you like, a tomboy? We, like, because you we, we, oh, we two yeah. boys. We told her oh, that yeah. the movie It, Stephen King's It, was a comedy. Oh, that wasn't nice. <laughs> that <laughs> no. that original movie, that I, miniseries was it was terrifying. It was frightening. It was terrifying. I yeah. am afraid of clowns to this day. Yeah. Yeah. And then what Steve else? doesn't like clowns either. And I balloons. Don't know. He yeah. hates balloons. He has a thing with balloons. Oh yeah, I couldn't pop them. Um. So um, <laughs> what? Yeah, I know it's weird. So so what was he like? Like. Growing up, I mean, was he? Did he play GI Joe? Like, what was his? Deal? He did. Like, he did play GI Joes. Yeah. In the sandbox, we had in a sandbox, sandbox in the backyard. A lot of Super Nintendo. A lot, lot of, of Super, Super Nintendo. Nintendo. She used to come over. This is why we bullied her sometimes. Sometimes my brother and I would be on the last level of Super Mario Brothers, and my sister would come over and just unplug it for no reason. Just why? No now, reason. why would you do something like that? Just to see us freak out. I just needed attention. I was yeah. very neglected, you very were? left out. Yeah, because I'm the girl, and yeah, they're best friends. And <laughs> so did it you? Was hard. So you were? Did wow, you grow she's up a tomboy. She's literally never oh, yeah. said this to me before. Completely a tomboy. <laughs> uh, I'm glad it's coming out on this podcast, Peach. <laughs> this is really. Yeah. Deep. I call her Peach. By so the way. are you closer to him or the eldest brother? Oh, that's that's hard. That is hard. You'd we be have her very on the spot. different relationships. Super, super different. Super different. Yeah. I did. We have this very intense chemistry. We we just we get we have each the same, other. We have the same sense of humor, I guess. Yeah. yeah really? Yeah. yeah. Twisted. And then he did he ever was he nice to you growing up? Like he didn't bully you. He did, for sure, in the way younger days. But like, like what did he then do? Then we what became did he, like best did friends. Did he like break later your on. Barbie doll? Like, did he break your toys or something? She used to hit us with her Polly Pockets. You did. Oh, he she used th- to do this. He threw out the Polly Pockets. She used to do this thing called Ninja Girl, N- where she. No come. one knows what Polly Pockets are yeah, unless what they're the, in that. I, you, when you said Polly Pockets, <laughs> I. I, I, I I, it could have been pita pockets or pizza pockets. I don't know. Yeah. Hot pockets. I have no idea what you're talking about. Like, like it, it's these little figurines. Do you remember Mighty Max? No. Okay. Well, there's little <sighs> figurines that you'd open in a little thing, and yeah. then you'd place them in different. Yeah. All yeah. Right, you're judging. No, me no, no I'm not. But okay. it, so they're toys. They're toys. So she would take a, a, a pillow sack full of toys that yeah. were hard, yeah. like action figures and stuff. And she would come in in the middle of the night and say, Ninja Girl is here. And she would hit my brother and I on our beds oh with a God. sack full of toys. That's crazy. That happened like one time. Uh, did you uh, remember any of Jeremiah's, like like his first girlfriend? Or like, what was what was he like? Was he a, When like, he was 24? Was he a, no, no, no. <laughs> I mean, she ain't lying, bro. No, I'm talking about she like childhood, lying. like like his first, like girlfriend. When he was 24, Steve. So he got no, girls didn't like. Oh no! He didn't date and like. Oh, girls loved him. They did, but he was like, nah. So girls liked Jeremiah mm-hmm. throughout his childhood, like starting from elementary school, middle school, high school. Oh, for sure. And did he like the, like he went to the dances and. Yeah, like, but but once he was at the dances, he, he wouldn't like want to dance with the girl, right? He would just want to like free for all in the middle of the dance floor. I like it. Oh, he on would, his own. Oh, like he would do his own like Michael J- like he would oh, be yeah. Michael Jackson. Oh yeah. <laughs> like, he yeah. would be moonwalking. Yeah, he's like I don't need oh, these so, bitches. You know what? <laughs> like, I, look at me. I was like that too. <laughs> Were you? Yeah. See that we Pop Warner got, dances. Oh, of course. Yeah, yeah, I would just be dancing by myself in the corner. Yeah. 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 Wow. Hey, can we get into some more questions in a second? Um, my sister and I actually wrote a song for you. Oh, really? We wrote a song for we you. Did. Like you two are going to do it? Yeah, we're going to do a, a brother-sister duet. I can't wait. Okay, cool. Can I put on the headphones for this? Uh, if you'd like to, yeah. I want to hear it okay, really cool. clear. I'm going to close my eyes so I can really listen. <laughs> and you can open them at any moment. Okay. Can you hear us all right? Oh, yeah. Okay, great. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. (laughs) 
Hey Steve, it's nice to call you brother. Hey Steve, I want to apologize for my mother. When she hit on you, I thought that it was strange. You deserve a woman that's closer to your age. If you married me, you'd really be his brother. Then you wouldn't have to have sex with my mother. So now it's time for you and I to get it on. I want a scissor baby in me before the break of dawn. So just bust a load in this scissor hoe. I promise my mom won't even have to know. Squirt inside my sister, I don't even care if you fist her. I just want her to be your missus, and you be her mister. Oh, 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 oh. I've been watching this show and everybody knows that you're packing heat. I'm gonna gobble it up like a Lunchable, it'll be my favorite treat. I'm gonna suck the skin off of your dick tonight I'm gonna suck it so good that your skin will turn white I'm gonna take your Korean noodle and slurp 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 it up I'm gonna take your fat kimchi and soak it in my guts Then you'll make scissor babies, and my sis will be a lady, and the world will know that we're really scissor bro. Scissor bro. We're really scissor bros. <laughs> really thoughtful song. I should have known that. Hold up. Do you like it? Uh, a little bit? It kind of caught me off guard. Yeah. But I should have. Do you have a semi right now? <laughs> <laughs> no, no, this is completely um, inappropriate. I, I have respect. I have utmost respect for the Watkins family. Oh, of course. Um, right, right. No, yeah, yeah, totally, Steve. Um, yeah. Mutual respect. The Mutual. line that the kimchi line and the skin off my penis <laughs> was a bit much. <laughs> um, uh, what else? There's a lot of things that are pretty problematic about the song itself. Um, what's the most disturbing is the angle of the scissor bros angle. If I impregnated you then we'd really technically that that really like kind of that, that like, bond us dude yeah but that like really like that, that bond ooh, us like wow you, you're willing to go to any length <laughs> to to do that dude yeah you have full permission to make love to my sister dude this is your sister dude <laughs> what it's your sister i know and i want her to marry a good man is that so much okay okay let me reverse let me reverse the roles I give you permission to stick your penis in my brother's butthole and to to come inside Bob's butt. I feel like he would and, take and up that, that offer. That would make you my sister brother. Let me talk to my wife. Oh my god! Only if I he will say he looking like a man. <laughs> oh my god! That was not Bobby Lee. That was Nicole. That was not Bobby Lee. Who was, that, was that? That was somebody else from that TV. That was like Nicole Sullivan or somebody. Oh my god! And that was just her age. It was a woman doing it. Oh she no! So you got the wrong guy. Wait, so you were on Mad TV, right? No. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Janessa, that's that's Bobby's brother. I'm his brother. Oh, I gotta go. <laughs> <laughs> Oh no! No, no, I'm kidding. I yeah. have a lot of respect for you. Yeah, I mean, she's a, a pretty I'm girl. A, and I'm everything. a huge fan. Yeah, yeah, huge yeah. fan. The why you don't realize the Watkins. The, you guys have good genes. The Watkins family has good, strong genes. Thank you so Thank much. You. Thank you. A strong that. gene pool going yeah. on. Yeah. yeah, I respect the Watkins. Yeah, if you respect me, then you'll impregnate my sister. I just gotta breathe. Oh. I won't make you wear the ball gag that my mom did. 
what are you talking about? <laughs> well, my mom filled her in on what you guys did. Yeah, I I saw the deleted scenes from yeah her episode. Well, refresh my memory, like what happened? She rode you on all fours. She put a ball gag in your mouth. She kept going, Steve, I'm yeah. your mom. You know. <laughs> yeah, there was a paddle. Janessa, what would you if you had a one night alone with my friend Steve? What would you What would you do to him in a locked room? I'm there's a lot going on. First of all, my breath is just fresh poo coming out your butt. So that in itself will deter you from even approaching uh this bubble. No. Uh there's that, some Actually that sentence just made me wet. <laughs> poo breath. <laughs> made you wet. If poo If breath. you could just put your penis in my butt for like Six to eight minutes or seconds. I mean, sit on my face or I'll sit on your face. You want him to sit on your face? I mean, I could sit on your face, but I kind of want you to sit on my face. Is that weird? It's That's called teabagging. Uh, yeah, that's my, not, okay. My, Sign my, me up. Yep. My nuts? Yep. My nut sack, mm-hmm. very, very dry. Mm. Very dry. Not if I get a hold of them. <laughs> oh my. All right, you guys won. I don't know if this is a game or no. No, Steve. you guys won the game. Steve, what do you mean we won the you game? You got me. I mean, this is you got uh, you got me moment. Stevie, you got me. Steve, would I ever lie to you? What are you talking about? Would I ever lie to you? What are you talking about? I want you to marry my sister. What the hell is your problem? There's a ring inside. What is your problem, man? This is your sister. You guys will be brothers. We'll literally be, literally, we'll be brothers. We'll be brother-in-laws. Brothers. Have you even been with the nation, man? Like seven, but none of them (sighs) could even... Oh, could never compare to you. You know it'd be crazy. What? Because I'm I'm playing along with it. What do you mean? But what if I flipped it on you and I go, okay, let's let's do it. Let's do what it. What if you did? She'd be she'd be ready. What if you dude, did? Dude, her eyes. Let's go. <laughs> her eyes so scared because I was dancing. Dude, her eye like I like <laughs> called it, and her eyes like lit up. Like her eyes got big. Let's do it. I'm let's so go. ready. <laughs> I, I was messing around, but you scared me. No, Janessa, no, I go saw, full force. I, go full force. I saw her eyes because I tried to call you on your bluff, but I saw it in your eyes. There's like no bluff. Janessa, desert island, deserted island. There's nobody else there except you and Steve. What do you do to him? Dude, what do you do? This is entertaining for you. I would what do you cover mean? his is... entire body in Vaseline. Oh. And I'd ride him like a unicorn. <laughs> Steve, come back! Steve, Steve, come back! Steve, come back! No, the unicorn line is. Just, you know, it's like, all right, good job, guys. Good job. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's fine. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> the unicorn, the unicorn, a, a bit much. The unicorn, the unicorn line is too much. It's too much. Yeah, okay, too come much. back, come back, too, come back, come back. It's too creative. It was okay. too creative. Okay, okay. My sister has to go soon. She is on a time crunch. Steve, can you? Can you add, if you have any if you have any questions for her, she does have to go very soon. I, I, think I need I time think to rub one out before I get back to my normal nightly routine before we leave. What's your normal nightly routine? Well, probably thinking of Steve. Yeah, I mean, rubbing one out to you, of course. Oh no, she just said she masturbates to you, Steve. Is that too much? Uh, a bit much. That's a bit much. But we are getting married. Uh no. I mean, you're uh, my what? you're my sister brother's sister. This is the yeah, like, full, like, again. Full blessing. What? Full blessing. Uh, again, full I, blessing. I respect the Watkins I'm a family. Sister. I know, but it's like Steve, I have to blessing. treat you like a sister. Steve, then. full blessing. Mm. I have to treat you like a sister. You know no, what I'm saying? It's more of like a step. Okay, but it's more like a step. I mean, we're from Kansas. <laughs> 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 well, we're not in Kansas anymore. <laughs> I, um, you realize I've been saving myself for you. That's what we do in Kansas. Like, we're virgins until our wedding night. 
You've been saving yourself for Steve, Janessa? Yes. What the hell? I want you to deflower me. It was nice meeting you. <laughs> Shake my head. That was cool. Thank you for meeting me. Thank you. Thanks for your time. Oh, good job. This is a good start. <laughs> <laughs> I do like we like my head. Good job. You guys got me. <laughs> Do you have any que- Do you have any questions for her before no, she goes? I, I think we covered it all. <laughs> okay. I, I think we well, thank uh, g- everybody at home. Give a round of applause to my yeah. baby sister Janessa. I love you so much. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you for letting me be a part of this. Thank you for collaborating. Beautiful thing that I, you, you know guys what? And you're created. right. I wouldn't have guessed that. I, I had no idea. I told you. I told yeah, you. Yeah. There's no way. I would okay, but who's? I have to ask. I already know what's going to happen. Before I leave. I, nope. I, I have to ask. One one question before I leave you. Okay, one question. Who's hotter, me or my mom? Oh, that's a hard one because you guys are equally beautiful in your own ways. Ew, he's so respectful. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Janessa, Janessa, would so. you say he's a simp? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Fine, oh, yeah. you are. Fine, you are. Slap me in the face or something. Choke me. <laughs> I mean, I know her tits are way bigger, but Jeremiah, <laughs> my mouth is more magical. Let me tell you that. <laughs> okay, we. I love you. I love you. You're I love you so much. You're the best. You're the best. Thank you for being here. You're the best. <laughs> Good meeting you. Nice meeting you. <laughs> Thank you for having okay. me. Okay, nice meeting you. I'll see you inside. <laughs> I love you. You can just send it there. It's good so meeting perfect. You. you guys got me so good. So good. Yeah, but if you do okay. want to marry her, then, you know, totally. Will you stop it with me, hooking me up with your family? She just said call call her. Do you want her number? Dude, that's your sister. Yeah, I know it's my sister. It's your sister. I know it's my sister. It's your baby sister. Yeah, I know it's my baby sister, but guess what? You got to You got to She's ready. Not do that. She's dude, ready. If you do this with your your older brother and me, we're done. My brother won't do it. Okay. He's a minister. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Cut. 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 And cut. Dude. Great line to end that segment. He's a minister. He is. Cut. Son of a gun. You know what? You're right. I do have respect. You have ultimate respect. Although your your sister is a pretty woman, right? Yeah. I would never do that because of respect. But even if out I, of respect, even if I gave you the blessing, out of respect. Even if, even if I was at the 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 doorway entry and Dude. I said I said I approve right before you walk in the bedroom. You like doing this content, man. This type of stuff with me. <laughs> did you like you our? Did. did you like our song though? It was so cringy to me. <laughs> Wait, hold up. It was so cringy to me. Mm-hmm. I wanted to just hop out of my skin and like fly to the moon and just. It. it, it I felt so uncomfortable uh-huh. and awkward. Yeah. Because it was well thought out. Yeah. Like you had specific lines about. The kimchi, you know, and the 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 penis skin. It's like what I mean. Like the, it, it took a lot of thought. Yeah, and, and it just really, yeah, it kind of bothered me. Okay, but I would never. I'm like I have respect, you know, because we're you know br- what sister I think, brothers. You know, what I think we need. What we need to do some we, scissors. We need to do some scissors. Yeah, or maybe should we cut to a dance break? Yeah, let's cut to a dance break. <laughs> Hey, I forgot the music. Can I add it in later? Absolutely. Heck yeah. All right. Now I, I figured with this this one we could do is as I wanted to do just just head dances. If you we've never done we've that. We've never before. done it. Let's try it. Okay, you. So you what? Ready? We can't move our bodies. We can't move our bodies. We can only move our heads. Okay. All right. All right. Ready? Okay. One, two, two. ready, go. Huh? <laughs>
Make sure you're locked. Make sure you're locked, okay? okay. That was fun. That was really fun. Really unique dance. We've never done that one before. That was a unique choice. I like that. It Maybe. reminded me of like bobbleheads or like Oh yeah, my neck yeah, is kind yeah. of feeling oh, yeah. it. But yeah, it's but good. it's good. It's fun. Did you did you dance along at home with us? I hope you did. And uh, if you did, submit submit it to scissorbrospod at gmail dot com. Yeah, we would why like not? To, we would like to see all of it. Yeah, and and by the way, while you're here, thank you for being here. Thank, thank you for you. liking and commenting. We and we always ask for the subscribers you, and we stuff. We appreciate y'all just watching the content. We see the subscribers. Going oh, and up. getting the shirts and all that. All that. We really appreciate. Yeah. Dude, somebody. Do you see this shirt that I'm wearing? That's amazing. Customized scissor T shirt. Amazing. Somebody brought this to me in Portland. I went to Johnson County Community College. Somebody made this shirt out of the Johnson County Community College like logo and put a scissor Scissors, in the middle. That's amazing. I love it. Thank you. Oh, yeah. Thank you. You're so cool. Um, I didn't mean to cut you off, but uh, we need to actually jump on this challenge this week because it's one of those challenges where we kind of need to do it like towards the beginning to sit through it. Steve, what do you mean to sit through it? Should I present it to you? I think we need to do it now. All right. Let the, I want to see it. Okay. So I realized lately we've been doing some gnarly challenges. The poo, the electrocution, yeah, the one hot of, beams. One of them you have to, now yeah. you have to sign in to watch it on YouTube. I know. The electrocution one. I know, but you it's You have okay. to sign in 18 and up the, to watch but, it now. But this one, we're avoiding that. <laughs> okay. You don't have to sign in. Okay. Because it has to do with relaxation. I like relaxation. Um, you've had arthritis before or muscle pain. Have I had arthritis before? Yeah, or just a muscle pain or cramps. Yeah, I've had some cramps, yeah. Okay, so I wanted to do something really relaxing. We don't have to do anything. We could just sit and here. And this is a challenge? Yeah. Okay. This is called capsation cream. It's made out of hot peppers. Um, This is a lot more... Stronger than Tiger Bomb and Ben Gay combined. So I was thinking, how did you even find out about this? Oh, Craig told me. <laughs> oh, your buddy Craig. Thanks so much, Craig. We appreciate you. We appreciate you. Um, we're going to both apply. I thought, the... Craig, I thought Craig was a good friend of mine. It's, <laughs> he it's is good, a good guy. It's good, he no, is a good no, guy. he's a good guy. But I'm he's saying, a great friend. He's he's a great friend. He's a great friend. I'm just saying, he uh. You kind of went behind my back. It's and, okay. Uh, it's okay. So we're going to apply <laughs> this uh, onto both of our nipples. We have to have our shirts off. The last couple episodes, we've been shirtless. I know. We'll, we'll, we'll cool it. We'll cool, cool it off. It. after. Next, it'll be different next week. But this, trust me, I, I had to test drive some of this. To, I might have to step in on some of these challenges. I might. I might. Well, we'll talk. Let's let's talk later about this because we need to get through this one. Okay. okay I'll let you, sorry. Let's I keep do that off, off camera. Okay. But uh, with this, um, I'm going to, we're going to have to apply it at the same time. Okay. Yeah. So I'm going to throw this, I'm going to go ahead. What questions do you have? Okay. So how does a person win? The person who doesn't wipe it off? Yeah. It's oh. similar to the other ones, but this is going to be a lot more intense because this is made of hot peppers. Okay. Um, and, my, and my question is, is how, what's the tiebreaker? Because you and I, you know, we sometimes tend to leave things on for a long time, even when we're in pain. If there is a no, but this is different because I I test drove this. I couldn't even I within a, a ten seconds I felt it. Within ten seconds, I'm just saying. I'm though, just I'm letting you know. Is, within a minute, you'll be like, "What is the tiebreaker?" Well, we're gonna might have to apply it to a different part of our body. What is the tiebreaker if we keep applying it to different parts of our body? We're not gonna make it that far. That's what you said in the past. No, but about this the is made out of hot peppers. It's I capsaicin it's, cream. I know. This is capsaicin cream. I understand cream. that, though. I'm just saying you have to think of these tiebreakers so people don't get upset. I said no more ties. 
I know, but one of us is going to give up. Unless okay. you want your nipples to fall off. What? Did you research this one? Enough. Take your shirt off. <laughs> Scissor Brothers! Hey, what's going on over there, funky cat? Just hanging with you. They have so many different flavors, like lemon berry bliss and bubbly lime. I mean, that's what I'm puffing on right now, my friend. But this isn't a cigarette or a vape, so what exactly is it, Steve? They're essential oils that are natural for you. There's no vape or cigarette smoke. Well, and it's made out of handcrafted Canadian wood. Maple, to be in fact, in clear. That sounds like a pretty good thing. Natural and essential oils going to your dome, helping you quit smoking and eliminate that filthy hand-to-mouth habit. Head to www.breathefume.com. That's breathefume and use code SCISSORBROS to save yourself 10% to help you or your loved one quit today. Use promo code SCISSORBROS, all right? When you go to www.breathefume.com, you won't be disappointed. To the sheath game, separate, separate my, my penis, penis and balls. I don't care if they're brown, white, or black. They're so dang comfy on an our nut sack. No, 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 no. Go to sheathunderwear.com. Mm-hmm. Use promo code SCISSORBROS to get 20% off your first order. At sheathunderwear.com, they give you a 100% money back guarantee if you're not completely thrilled. These things are so comfy, we're wearing them on our top heads as well as our bottom heads. Go to sheathunderwear.com. Use promo code Scissor Bros. I get 20% off. These boxers work really well when you're jerking off or you're not. They're comfy at any time. <laughs> Go to sheathunderwear.com. Use promo code Scissor Bros. And trust us, they're as comfy as they look. <laughs> That's it. You hit it off the ballpark. <laughs> you think they'll like that? <laughs> what? I mean, we're wearing underwear on our heads and the butt. Uh, can we take a look at how we did? That was really fun. It was good. <laughs> Why did you grab the bat? Why did you grab the fucking bat? Whoa, what's that, Steve? This is the new Scissor Bros P.O. Box. Oh. Cool. So what can people send to that? They could send challenge ideas, fan mail. And by challenge ideas, you mean actual physical items for challenges, right? Yes, sir. Yeah. And not only that, they could send instruments. Ooh, weird ones or normal ones. Like a ukulele. Or a keyboard for Steve so we could do dueling keyboards. Like a Casio keyboard. Or a baritone saxophone. (laughs) Yeah, or like a really fancy flute. Or a fancy flute for Steve. Or Congo drum? Or <laughs> whatever you want to send. Whatever you want to send. Send it right here. <laughs> to Scissor Bros at P.O. Box number 78375 at 4960 West Washington Boulevard, Los Angeles, California, 90016. Now let's get back into this beautiful episode of Scissor Bros. So this is what's going to happen. I'm going to apply on two fingers, your middle finger and your index finger, a good amount. You don't need much. I love (laughs) this. is why I live for this. Just watching your facial expressions. I love it. Um, You know what Steve said to me? Wait, 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 wait. no, no, no. Let me just say this. Wait, hold up. I'm explaining. I know. I'll get to that in a second. You said to me, 
when the cameras weren't rolling, when we had he went right after my easy sis- there. Think about what you're about to say. Easy. I am right after my sister left. You looked at me like pure evil. You go, I can't wait till we get to the challenge. <laughs> this is <laughs> Steve said. I can't wait till we get to the challenge. All right. So this is okay. Thanks for letting him know. <laughs> I need for you. Okay. To do this. Yes, you got it. Each finger on one. Aye, aye, sir. A finger for a nipple. Aye, aye, sir. Okay. Aye, aye. Aye, aye, sir, Captain. I got hands. Okay, got it. I know. So as you can see. It just says arthritis pain relief. Topical anal G-G-sick hey, cream. Eh, you're anal doing G-G-sick. the wrong thing right now. I don't need you to be reading. I need you to be applying. It's already burning your hand? No, I, no, 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 no. It's okay, not, look, but, look, okay, look. Okay, so Here? your index finger. And the middle and finger. And your middle finger. Okay, so at the from three to one, I need you to start applying uh, the cream on uh, one on each nipple. So one finger on here, and then one finger. Exactly. Okay. Ready? One second. Oh, I'm it's gonna... already burning my fingers. I okay, can feel okay. it. Okay, ready. Five, four, four three, three, two, two one. one. Apply. All right. When are we switching nipples? Right now. And then switch it, but then keep rubbing it in. Keep rubbing it in. Okay. <laughs> this looks so weird. We're just heavily breathing and rubbing our nipples on camera. It's not sexual, YouTube. Yeah, it's not. Don't worry about it. But it's just kind of weird. I know, but just keep in a circular motion, in a circular motion. Oh, no, I'm going to do it in squares. Okay, Steve. in a circular motion. Okay, and then I guess when you, look, can I see? Can you can you can I, can you like sit up just a little bit? I just want to see what's going on over with you. Yeah. So okay, okay, that looks good. Okay, just uh, and then with the X, I think that's good enough. Let me see your other nipple, your right nipple. Uh, yeah, yeah. And then look at mine. Yeah. So just to just to let them know it's fair. Okay. And then I guess wipe wipe the rest off your fingers with the paper towel. Okay. And then good. Then we can move on. Now, are you feeling anything right now? Yes, I am. <laughs> Well, describe, describe what you're feeling. Okay, what I'm starting to feel um, is a uh, is a burning sensation with it feels it burns. It feels like it's like fire ants. It's with little needles. It feels like I'm being stung by little bees. That's like fire like. ants just biting on your nipples. Yeah. Okay, how are you feeling now? Because I'm feeling something. It's kind of it hurts. It hurts. Right? It hurts pretty bad. See. So now we just. We have to sit through the pain. <laughs> so do we continue on with the episode? And Yeah. Yeah, I told you. Okay. We might have to raise a bar, though. I thought about it. My nipples I'm are hurting pretty bad right now. Mine are, too. Pretty like, bad. really freaking bad. I told you. Can I Wait, re- wait hold up. Describe, describe again. Well, okay. I don't like it when you read this stuff. Why not? Wait, go ahead. Read it to Why read not? it. Read it off. Stop and use and ask doctor if condition worsens, redness is present, irritation develops, symptoms persist for more than seven days, or clear. My nipples are throbbing right now. I know. I know. I told you it hurts. It's like fire. It's like so. It's it feels like uh someone uh, is taking a lighter. Oh. Hey, don't 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 take any off. I'm not taking um, any it's, off. It feels like someone's taking a lighter and like lighting a lighter for each nipple. It hurts, doesn't it? Yeah. It burns. Well, the other ones that we've done, there wasn't a throb to it. My, my nipples this is are a throbbing. throbbing. It's like the flaming hot Cheetos of nipple cream. And that's an ad for <laughs> Capsation <laughs> HP. The flaming hot Cheetos of topical creams. <laughs> yeah, might, this hurts really. It hurts really. Even bad. My, the fingers that the residue that it was on. That's yeah. why I put it on my left hand because I have to take out my contacts later time, yeah. and I didn't want them in my right hand. Yeah. Should we put one dab in her butt? You think? I don't want to. Just one. Steve, I really yeah, that really would don't really want to. burn. I really don't want to. But we have to. Okay, that's the tiebreaker then. The butthole? Yeah. I might be giving up on this one, actually. What? My nipples are legit. 
It feels like my nipples are gonna jump off my chest. Oh, I know. And this is a thing because I had a I had to test it a little bit, like, and I felt this. But once, even, uh, does it hurt? Just... Hey, you can't blow on them. Well, there's no rule. What do you mean there's no rule? You can blow on your nipple. Hey, you you change the rules all the time when we do this. Did challenge. I say anything? I said you just can't wipe it off. You can, you blow, can blow on blow your on nipples. Them? Okay, fine. I'll blow on my nipples. If you ended up on this video, you're in the weird part of YouTube. We're bl we're grown with blowing on our nipples to cool them off from capsation cream. Oh, hi, let's give him give him an update. How are you feeling hey. now? You didn't rub any on Gerald's head, no, did you? Dude, I wiped it off on a paper towel. No. Gerald, are you feeling anything on your head? Okay, what the fuck was on his fingers? I mean, hey, Steve, quit kissing my throat. I'm burning up over here. Was that capsations? Okay. Oh my god, I'm allergic. It looks. It seems to me like you're struggling on this challenge. Yeah, I am struggling a little bit, Steve. This one hurts really bad, and maybe I'm tired of being oh, in pain on this show. Yeah, I know. Maybe I'm just tired of that. You know, we should do a that. nicer one next week. Oh, really? Yeah, we'll do a nicer one. Oh, okay. So, uh. It's getting worse, isn't it? Yes. It's like now a torch is being applied. It feels like, you know, the things that you hook up to your, your car battery jumper cables? Mm -hmm. It feels like jumper cables are on my nipples right now. Really? It literally, I have heartbeats in each nipple going. <laughs> is it, Should wait, we? Wait, wait. Uh, what if our nipples fall off? You give up. I'm asking you, what if our nipples fall off? And your first it question is, do you like, give up? It sounds to me like you're giving up. And it's okay. Your family loves you. Answer me this one question. Your sister's visiting Answer me you. this one question. Your mom loves you. Answer me this one question. <laughs> what? Are you the devil? No. Okay, you know what? We don't have to do the butthole now. But what if we do... um? <sighs> What if we apply it under our armpits? Oh, God. <laughs> I mean, I guess we can. I mean, it just... Okay, yeah. So, okay, so... Um, <laughs> no, because we have to get things going. So, um, put... Do the same method. Put your middle finger, your yeah. index finger. Has anybody ever... And then <laughs> we got to put it underneath our armpits. <laughs> oh, you know that's going to burn. Oh, I put too much on this one. And then you have to actually put it, uh, like, apply it under your armpits like body, uh, like deodorant. Really coat the hair, uh, armpit hair. No, no, you have to get past the hair. You got to get past the hair onto the skin under your armpits. Okay, does that make sense? Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so I'm going to do the same. <sighs> I know it hurts. See? Oh, oh no. Yeah. I'm getting really inflamed, Steve. Did you re did did you did you look up like if you don't have arthritis like like did you look this up before? Don't worry about it because you could buy it over the counter now. Like play um Steve, apply. That's not my freaking okay, question, so dude. Raise your arms. Are you ignoring me now? <laughs> yeah, well, raise your arms. Steve, are you ignoring me? Listen, dude. We have to get it going. Fine. And then I'll answer. It. Okay, so okay, is that okay? Okay, dude. Apply. Are you ready? Yeah. Okay, apply. No, circular, large circular. I'm doing large circulars. Like this. This is, I mean, just. <laughs> Guys, I hope you like this because Steve okay. loves this. And then, okay, your other armpit, transfer the cream oh my goodness. onto the other armpit like this. No, but you have to go in circle like deep. I'm going in on, circles. Past the armpit hair. I am. Pass the hair Steve, onto the skin. Steve, I am. Okay. Again, again. Make sure both are coated real good. I, dude. My nipples are on fire. I, They're on fire. I know. They're on fire. I know. Okay, hold up. And then you could actually wipe the excess excess cream uh, with the paper towel. Can oh, my God. My armpits are on fire. Oh, really? Oh, 
Can we read the letter while we do this? Yeah, let's read the letter. We had a fan. A scissor sister yeah, wrote into the show. And bring that mic towards your mouth. Oh, my goodness. Oh. Okay. Okay, so this, you want to give him some context? So uh, yeah. it was kind of like uh, the, the that one female scissor sister uh, uh, wrote in a... Uh, uh, hold up, this is going to be hard. Um, <laughs> okay, it's like that one letter. Remember about the... There was somebody only, who sent Steve an OnlyFans yeah, letter. Yeah, like OnlyFans thing. And uh, and Steve was too nervous to click on the OnlyFans link. <laughs> yeah, keep keep talking, keep and, talking. How about and, you do this? Yeah, go ahead, go ahead. And uh, uh, so another girl wrote in on behalf of that other girl, and uh, who's also, I guess, um, she's in the field, I guess. And she wrote a nice letter to Steve and I. She goes, "Hey guys, smiley face." So I'm watching today's episode, and when you first started reading the email from the girl about the OnlyFans, I was seriously concerned that I had gotten stoned and wrote in and then forgot. Smiley face. I'm a sex worker too, and some of your conversations before about OnlyFans and such had tempted me to write in, but I didn't want to be creepy. Mostly, I just want to reassure Steve that the girls who contact him aren't doing so out of pity. Trust me, as someone who could relate that's out of the thirst out of thirst, not pity. LOL. Yes, OnlyFans is a paid porn site, but I also use mine to share files easily with people I genuinely like. Plus, it's a huge compliment if someone gives you that long of a subscription for free. You want to take over? Mm-hmm. Don't count sex workers out of your pool of potential dates. We tend to be the most laid back and fun. And I bet way more girls are thirsting over Steve than he thinks. Parentheses. Jeremiah too, but we know he's off the market. Congrats on the baby. Thank you. That's nice. You are both walking thirst traps. Wait, hold up. What's a thirst trap? Like, we never drank on... Is it we drink a lot of... We trap wa bottle water in a trap? <laughs> what the hell is a thirst trap? It's, it means we, I've never heard that. It means we trap thirsty women who are like well, wanting. Well, if you if they're thirsty, just give them some water or give them something to drink. It's not. It means it means it's an internet term that means like these girls who like want it, like sex. Yeah. Okay. They're thirsty. That I means don't know a lot of these terms. Okay. That I means that you. we're I got, traps. Okay, I got it. I got and, it. And that basically what the basically she's saying what people are looking at right now are a couple of thirst traps, and that's yeah. the first time I've ever heard that. My armpits are on. Fire. I feel like someone put a, a torch to him. Uh, okay, so keep reading it. Anyway, thank you for making excellent content. Scissor Bros is my favorite podcast, and I listen and watch many. <sighs> my nipples are going to fall off. Congratulations on the vaccination. I'm very proud of you, Steve. A heart. I got my second one a few weeks ago. I'd give you a free trial of my OnlyFans, but I don't want to trigger <laughs> suicidal thoughts. Crying face emoji. Uh, I'm on Twitter at Kinky Milky Mint, though, if you ever want to see a big butt and learn about lactating without pregnancy. Tons of love. Care me. Pronounced like Jeremy, but with a K. Not concerned with my anonymity. Smiley wow. face. So she's she's basically saying, dude, I might have to I might have to throw in the towel on this one. This one's this one's this one's killing my this one's killing my ar armpits and my knit. My armpits and nips but the competitive side of me does not want to throw in the towel but the logical side of me says to give up and wipe it off because you could be dam doing damage to your body but the it competitive burns. side I mean of me there's no other way to put it, it it's it burns my armpits are burning my mm. nipples are burning dude mm. you oh my god it looks like there's like a red moon. Oh no, your nipples are doing it too. Yeah, you look we like. Hold up, let's show the camera like the the, the two red moons. Have tits. I know. It looks like we have tits. Oh. <sighs> <laughs> it looks like we have titties. Okay, so let's just continue. You wanna? 
You want to continue with the po- the pod? Yeah. So speaking of pain. Yeah, you got me good last okay, week. Okay. So. Okay. I want to. Let's c- talk about the methods of striking. Okay. You had the advantage. So I want to. Let's cut to a video of Steve <sighs> revealing the bruises on his leg to me from last week. Oh yeah. Please cut to it. Hey Jeremiah. Look what you did to me, buddy. <sighs> Just want to show the evidence. There you go. So I just fall asleep. Oh. Ah! <laughs> ah! I'm so sorry. You got me good, buddy. I'm so That's sorry. That's why I'm sick of it now. <laughs> Steve, I didn't. You didn't leave any long-term marks on me. Well, oh, really? Look. Yeah, that's because you had the better grip. There's nothing. Yeah, you had the better grip. You got me good, buddy. I'm so sorry. Ready for our challenge on Wednesday? I didn't mean to hurt it's you. It's okay, man. We've got another challenge this week, buddy. I'm so Hopefully, I'll. I'm what are you so laughing? I'm so sorry. Dude, that's why I'm taking a nap. I need time to recuperate. It's okay. That's why you were yeah, sleeping buddy. and you weren't yeah, answering I'm your phone? I'm sleeping. It's because you're resting I'm off resting, the bruises. I'm resting my bruises. It's okay, buddy. I feel like a terrible friend. Are you going to get me back with the challenge this week? We've got a brand new week. Okay. A new day. I'm looking forward to it. Okay. I have to apologize again. I didn't know I hurt you that bad. Yeah, you did. Because you had the inside Thor strike. I had the, the, the backhanded light tennis stroke strike. Okay. I know this hurts a lot. This one is. <laughs> this is it hurts. This is one of the more dude. I'm not gonna lie. This is one of the more painful ones that we've I done. I know. I told you it hurts. <sighs> oh my goodness! Nipple, ah. nipple cream and, ah. and pit cream. I got. Ah. You give up. You give up. You give up. You give up. Butthole. <laughs> Uh, you know what I'll do? You know what I'll do? What? I'll concede if you put it on your butthole. I'll concede right now. If you put it on your butthole, I'll I'll I'll, I'll take the L on this one. Deal. But, shake on it. Shake shake on but it. But listen, but listen. I get to wipe mine off and you have to leave it on your butthole the rest of the podcast. <sighs> give me at least 20 seconds. All right, to think th- about th- it? Give me 30 seconds. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. But I get the win, but I get the win. You get the win. But you have to leave it on your butthole the rest of the podcast. Okay, hold up. I have one other question. Okay. If I do put it on my butthole, can I wipe it off? Because I'm about to start bleeding. Wait, hold up. uh, I'm really about to start bleeding. Let me finish my... Okay, I'm sorry. Okay. If I wipe it off my nipples and my armpits, both, Mm -hmm. is that... And I put it... Apply it on my my anus, is that fair? Where I just have to endure the anus pain um, throughout the the rest of the podcast. I'll let you wipe the nipples and, and... And my armpits. Or maybe I should just let you wipe one of them. Dude, that's not okay. A fine, good I'll let you yeah, wipe both of them. Yeah, because dude, it's gonna be on the, uh, the, uh, on that's the one hole. of the rawest parts of your body. Okay, fine. Your anal skin. Okay, fine. Your anal skin. Okay, fine. If we're feeling this on just this, yeah. Your anal I'm, skin. Because th- I'm, I'm honestly, my nipples feel like they're going to jump off. But my I body. win. But I get to win. But dude, do you know how much pain I'm gonna be in the rest of? We still have like 20 minutes. I mean. I'm going to be in Are so- you are you going to be able to to finish the podcast with it in your butthole? Oh, we're going to have to find out. Ooh, do I give him do <sighs> I get do I give up on this one? I don't know. I think we would almost be even again if I give you this this win. A truce. I'm not it won't be a truce. You'll you'll beat me fair and square if you put it on your butthole. Let's let's get things going, man. Let's Make some decisions, man. Let's, okay, let's get going. I'm going, going to say that if you put it on your butthole right now, then you, I have to wipe this out. No, or? you can wipe it off after you put it on your butthole. Oh God damn it! Do you accept? Yes, but I win. You win. Shake on, dude. Shake my hand on it. I uh, no, no. You sit down. I want to go to you. I really don't want to do this, but oh my goodness. Oh my (laughs) 
A little bit more. Dude, have some compassion, dude. I'm just saying you have, have to if you're going to get some compassion. If you're going to get the win from me, you better do it fully. Mm? <laughs> the way you're slow I hear your fingers slowly going in and out it's so gross did you rub it around did you do circles yeah. did you do circles did you do circles yeah it's in there now you can wipe off your 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 teats and, and your pits uh. Uh. uh-huh that was a bad choice oh that was a bad choice dude I need to wipe it off too Wipe it off. You can wipe it off your pits and stuff. No, I haven't yet. I'm just saying you can. Ooh, this feels so good. Oh, I'm s I, okay. This this one was worth me taking the L on. Thank you, Lacroix, for cooling my pits and my nips. Lacroix, the cooler of pits and nips. Oh my goodness. I've never enjoyed LaCroix more. Oh my goodness. Oh yeah. That's good. That's some good stuff right there. Is this going to scar? Oh dude, I'm in so much pain. Oh. Yeah. You don't uh, know what I'm feeling, man. I don't know what you're feeling. You have no idea what I have I'm no idea through. what you're feeling right now. Dude, seriously, man, you might have to take me to the hospital. What? That something's going on, dude. Take take it off your butthole then. Take it off your butthole. I don't no, want you to go no, into the no, hospital. No, no, I wanna I wanna at least Steve, I, I said to you, you you'll still win, buddy. You'll still win, okay? I do not want you going to the hospital. This is where my my care for you comes in and I want <sighs> you to take it off. If Let's it, continue the podcast. For how dude, I don't know, dude, man. Everything's burning, but my butthole is like like they like a blowtorch is like inside of it. <sighs> yeah, like inside of it. Oh my goodness. Uh, oh, it took the skin. It, it's taking the hair off my nipples. Oh, frick, dude. Yeah, this burns really, really bad. How do but, I look? Uh, can you throw the label? You look pretty rough. Can you throw? Can you throw the um? Can you throw that to me? I just want to check real quick. I got hands. Um, this says, um, take it off your butthole now. Take it off your butthole now. Why? It says for external use only. Yeah, cause dude, look at me. Uh, do you also have the inside carton for this? The inside carton that this came in. No. It says, if severe burning occurs, discontinue use immediately and read inside carton for important information. Do not expose the area treated with the product to heat or direct sunlight. Do not use it at the same time as other topical uh, uh, anal G6. Anal G6. Stop use and ask the doctor if condition worsens. Redness is pregnant. Redness is present. Irritation develops symptoms as pain, swelling, or blistering where the product was applied. It's hot peppers, man. Ah. Uh. If medicine comes in contact with hands, wash with soap and water. I'm gonna have to go get a soap and water, buddy. I'm gonna have to. It's still my butthole. I know, we're gonna have to wash your butthole with soap and water. Yeah? I don't want to see you like this. Do I still win? You still win, buddy. Okay. I love you. I, I, appreci I, love you, I, I appreciate dude, the commitment. You don't know what I'm feeling. I, I can tell you have I no can tell the difference. This is a different level of pain. I've never seen you like this before. Well, you have no idea what I'm, I'm feeling. I'm getting a little bit worried. It's way worse than Tiger Bob. You have no idea what I'm feeling. I'm gonna go get a soap and water. This is crazy. I'll go get a soap and water. I need to at least wipe it off my butt. You're gonna wipe it off your butt. I'm gonna get you toilet no paper. You have no idea what I'm feeling right now. Okay. This is crazy. I'll be right back. But I'm a champion. <laughs> Did you just fart? That was my mouth. It's a weird laugh. I don't know what's going on. What are we on. doing on <laughs> this podcast? I don't know, dude. We have to simmer it down. This is ridiculous, Steve. Can we say? Can we? Can we? 
Dude, I'm sweating. Uh, Steve, I don't want to say that. I, Steve, I don't want to say that that we should stop doing challenges for yeah, a while. But we gotta, but sub- we I gotta, gotta wipe this off my butt. Okay, okay, dude. let me go get. Jeez. I'm so sorry, Jeremiah. This is a horrible idea. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Okay, so we're back. Um, we you had to really pause. We had to pause. I had to go inside and uh, I had to go to the my first aid kit that I haven't really used very much. Um, there's a bunch of band aids and stuff in there, and we ended up using a um, stuff for burns for first and second degree yeah, burns. I mean, I have to admit, this one was really, really. This really was our hard. most painful one. I'm not I like. I'm not. You know, it was. This was no act. This no, cap. There, the capsation. No, there's no act. It was. So something painful. was really messed up about that one. The the way that it hit, it was like a different dude. It was worse than the Ben Gay and the way Tiger Bomb worse. and the Tiger Bomb. It was worse than Ben Gay, Icy Hot, Tiger Bomb put together. Everything. It was crazy. It was horrible. It was. Do you know what it was like? I mean, look at you, dude. You look like you have like Mars is on both, like one on each nipple. Like there's a planet, like a red planet. Look at me too. I'm no right. <laughs> Dude. Dude, you have to show them. This looks... I mean, it's insane. Look. it's You look insane. I wore, I wore a beanie to match you tonight. <laughs> that's, you are, that, you, that's what you have to say after this gruesome challenge? You wanted to talk about fashion? I, I wanted to match you tonight. That's great. Well, we're Scissor Brothers. It's good. Like It's yeah. like the striped shirts, like that thing. But that was like, I, that was unplanned. This one was planned. Oh, it was? Yeah, I did this one yeah, on purpose. Yeah, but I mean, let's, uh, you know what? We have to push forward. We're almost We're almost at the finish Can line. Can we do some scissors to cleanse everything yeah, that's been yeah. going on? You know on? what? That would help because... Uh, With the airflow. Let's do over the head scissors. But like, yeah. Okay. Ready? Yeah. Five, four, three, two, one. One, two, three, four, five, six. Do it with us. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Make sure you don't 11, ever put capsation 12, on your body 13, if you don't 14, have arthritis, kids. 15, really don't 16, do that. 17, 18, 19, and 20. 21, 22, 23. 24. Can we do like a couple like really slow yeah. ones like 25, 25 and then like 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 maybe let's just end on a weird like a like a 20 like the seagull yeah like the a clouds. seagull like a like, like, caca, 20, caca, like caca. 26 like caca. yeah do the these are the uh the flock of seagulls oh we should do this do a couple scissors while blowing on our pet so like <sighs> caca, caca. <sighs> Okay, I feel better. Okay. Yeah, okay, let's emphasize this. We want to do a disclaimer. Um, yes, kids, adults, any Just human don't being, do, that. do not do this at home. That one seriously I was repeat, the most painful. Do not use capsation lotion at home. I want to put the warning thing right on the screen. Do not try it. It is so painful. Just for just for I just want to 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 ask you and the viewers this question. And I'm totally fine with doing challenges every episode. I really am. But this is a serious question. Do you think we should do challenges every episode? Do you think so? I'm asking you that, and I'm asking you, the viewers and listeners. Will you comment below on your thoughts? I really want to do an honest poll on this because I'm thinking of, of us and the longevity of this show. Oh, wait, and I like, I are like those all your the concerns? challenges. Oh, because you're can – I, can I try to dig in deeper yeah. With the, yeah. in, into that comment? Yeah. Because at this rate – that's what I'm saying. Hold on, let me finish. At this rate, we are gonna just dead be by so episode messed 20. up at the end. Like, I mean, dead by can episode. Can you imagine 20. a year from now? No, oh, hey, like welcome. our hair's falling out. <laughs> <laughs> hey, welcome, Hi, guys. welcome to the uh, the Senior uh, Brothers podcast. You guys I'm, I'm missing scissors? all my teeth. Uh, cause of Steve's challenge from episode 38 and, uh, you know, when our teeth fell out. I just think that we need to go out of the realm of pain challenges. I think we really need yeah, to. Yeah, let's do more, you know, we should like make the, it, like the, let's the, do more fun. What was br- our funnest one? The underwater one, I'm just saying like that, stuff like that is not painful, but it's still it's entertaining. Challenging. It's challenging. You know what? You're right. Just to, I'm just, can I do, maybe can I do the challenge next week? Can I take it? Yeah. 
I know that that's like your thing, but that's like my thing. or or okay, I'll give you another what chance. If I, I'll give you another chance. What if I swear I vow to you mm-hmm. that next week's challenge will not be painful. Okay. At all. Okay. All right. Scissor pinky promise. Scissor pinky promise. All I'm right. still having fun with you, brother. I'm I love dude, I'm having a blast with I love you, you even you though know, you know you know the love's still there. The love is still there. Yeah, but just the and pain, I don't mean but, to, but the pain is there. And too. I don't mean to offend you with uh, the the possibly wanting to do a challenge. I'm just saying like, you know No, you're not, but you know, it's kinda like I really it's so special to me. I know. I know. It's ch- you know what I mean? No, I get it. It's close to yeah, your heart. Yeah, it's close to but your heart. I, and I promise you, you know, like we need to get off the pain, pain anyway. But then I look down at my nipples and I'm like, okay, well maybe I should do the next challenge. <laughs> but you don't know what's going on in my anus. Okay. I mean, okay. imagine what you, how you're feeling there. But in your I'm body. hiding it well. Yeah. But there's a lot of things going on. It looks like you have two hookers attached to your chest who just put on a ton of blush. I know. <laughs> good analogy that's a great analogy um what's uh, it looks like the inside of an orangutan's butthole okay okay just two of those look we're both messed up mm-hmm. and i didn't think our, like my armpits are burning too like yeah. everything's burning the burn gel helped a lot it yeah. really did thanks thanks for that mm-hmm. uh, let's continue man let's um, just let's keep it on the more positive tip okay well this is a weird subject that happened today uh i feel like i had an nde that happened today do you know what that is no, and I asked you about it, and you said, wait for the segment. So yeah, I'm yeah. waiting. I've been waiting to hear what that is. What's that an, an acronym NDE for? An NDE is a near-death experience. Oh, near-death experience. So I was out of the beach today. Yeah? And I went boogie boarding. I saw the uh, I saw the boogie board in, near the bathroom. Yeah. Uh, it was the first time in my life where I thought that I wasn't going to come back up. Were the waves big? Dude... How big was it? No, no, just give me Here's the problem context. with the waves. Usually when you, you know when you ride a wave, like you catch it perfectly? Yeah. It's a smooth descent, right? Yeah. These waves were too rough where they would go up like this and then just crash immediately. How big were they? They were rough today. Well, I want to say, I don't want to, I don't want to, I, I, I'm not like a, like an avid surfer, so I don't want to exaggerate. Right. But, but I, just, just, I do have footage. Oh, can we see it? So you guys can judge how bad that really was, but I kept getting pulled under. The lifeguard came by in an SUV to check on me to see if I got out all right. They came by and they were about to pull me out of the water. So I'm guessing the waves were at least like five feet. At least I think at, they're more like ten feet. At least, dude. At, at least. At least. I caught one, and I was like, "Yes, I caught it." But it was, and then it threw me it, down. You, it, you descend. Yeah. It down. Yeah. Yeah. There were big waves. Probably. Yeah, there were big waves. And you're not an avid like. It's not like no. I'm not. Taking I didn't know. Any, I didn't know how to manage myself. But the thing is, I'm not. It's not like you're a professional bodyboarder. No. You're just like, a, it's a recreational Dude, thing you I do. Kept, this is the first time in my life, Steve, and I've gone boogie boarding Dude, a lot over so the years. Scary. I came up and I was so disoriented because I kept being thrown under the water that when I looked up, I didn't know which way was ocean and which way was land. I was, I was, I kept- Were you there by yourself in the water? My wife was taking that footage and then she got really worried about me. And then the lifeguard came by in an SUV and and I got out and the lifeguard said, you, you got pulled under by a rip- current that was really strong and i was about to ha- have to come in and get you like if you didn't come out i was starting to get worried about were you. were you panicking at, at dude, all dude yes oh dude i i had a thought i had a thought today and this is not to, like to bring the podcast down or anything but it was just like a real experience where i was like i might not come up i might not come up right now oh my goodness and i and it wasn't one of those things where you know and i don't think it's truly an nd because like i still had oxygen and stuff like that but I didn't have that moment where I was like, oh, like my life flashed before my eyes. I just kept thinking, I might die right now. I might die right now. People have died during yeah. a Dude. like bodyboarding. No, that, that has, be no, to, I'm talking to die by boogie board. No, 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 no. But these instances, because there's like a reef or something, and their head hits the reef. Oh, I got thrown so hard, dude. Well, wait, wait, wait. Can you can you tell them what beach or what break it was 
for context as well. It was out on the west side. It was like uh, and like Playa was it Malibu? Del Vista. Like Playa Del Vista. Playa like Marina, Del Vista. You know, near Marina Del Rey, it's like out by that highway and stuff like that. And it, it was the waves are bigger than normal. I I looked around after I got out and I was like, oh, that's why I'm the only one in the ocean. I was the only one in the ocean. Because the waves are crazy. Yeah, and the lifeguard was telling me. I wish I was there with you, brother. I wish too, because you probably would have told me to not go in the water. But you at least have fun and catch some waves? No. <laughs> I'm sorry. What? I just told you I almost died, and you're like, did you catch some waves? <laughs> I Will caught, you invite me next I time? I caught one fun one. Yeah, if you want to go, yeah. I want to go. Uh, let me get the stuff. Okay. I'll, I'll, dude, I would love to do a Scissor Bros day at the beach. The only reason. Oh, I, yeah. We should make it a day, like a, a vlog. I would love to make it one. We got to do it. Let's do it. Yeah. Okay. Let's do it. The only reason. Wait, I, how cold was the water? The only, the only reason I didn't invite you because my sister was there and I didn't want to ruin the surprise of her coming on the pod. That's why I didn't invite you. Otherwise, I would have. Because I told you the last time I went to the beach, I was going to invite you the next time. I'm that, just telling you. you. Know, no, 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 no. That makes perfect sense. Yeah. That makes sense. Yeah. I'm sorry that happened to you, brother. No, have you ever had anything like that happen? Yeah, when I was younger, yeah. Well, an NDE? Yeah, well, like, yeah, well, I felt the way you did. With where boogie I'm like, boarding oh, or what? Like, I can't, like, where I got hit, like, where I was, like, I was in the whitewash, and I was, like, just panicking, you know what I mean? Yeah. It's scary. Oh, yeah. Yeah. You know the word, even, uh, let's, let's add another element into that. Imagine going through that, but then you have, uh, like, a thigh cramp where your leg locks up. Because that's happened to so me too. The, so when I was trying to swim out of it, Steve, yeah. this is when I thought that I might not come back. I was using every muscle in my body and I felt like I was fighting the entire ocean. Oh, yeah. Because it I, it wasn't doing anything. The only thing that was my saving grace was <sighs> another wave came in after I popped back up and I was like, I put my boogie board up and I caught enough of a wave to get out of the rip current. You could have, it could have gone way worse. Oh, I know. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like I could see it in your eyes. Dude, I, I got shook today. I've never, that's never happened to me before. Now, do you have a more of a respect for Mother Nature? Yeah. You gained respect for it, didn't you? Oh, she taught me a lesson today. Right? Yeah, she taught me a lesson. Respect it. Oh, I respect her now. Because nature is not nice. No. It, nature will was, gobble today, you up. No nurture. There was all nature. Yeah. Yeah. You faced your grizzly bear in the water today, yeah. my friend. Earned another stripe, man. <laughs> Earned another stripe. I'm so sorry you went through No, no. That. I'm, yeah. 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 Um, on another side note, uh, you know, I went back to the King and the Sting. Shout out to Brendan and Theo and Nick and Chin. Dude, they love you over there. They love you so I much. Have a good time. Yeah, they, they love they kinda, you so they much. They kind of caught me off guard in one of the segments, but you know. They love you so much. I'm like, are they trying to steal my scissor, bro? No, they're not, but they did bring you up. And I did bring us up. In what context? I challenged them. Scissor Bros versus King and the Sting dudes. Scissor Alphas versus the Betas. We're like the nerds. You oh, know, we're like Revenge of the Nerds. Here. I think everybody's aware where yeah, we're at. We're the, the nerds. Pole. We're aware of it. We're the underdog yeah. nerds. Yeah, we're aware of it. But I said, hey, guys, like, uh, you know, because I told them about the challenges and the different examples of the challenges that we've done. Yeah. And they weren't into it. They turned us down? Yeah. What? Yeah. So this is a call to action. <laughs> what do you mean? You know how I'm we... I'm just surprised. Oh, yeah, hold up. manly men. I'm just surprised. I know. Kind of, that I kind mean, of they're me masculine off. gladiators. I mean... Brendan used to be a professional of, fighter, dude. They're scared of a bunch of nerd. Like, we're scrawny little dudes. We just put stuff on our nipples. Yeah, but they're, <laughs> they don't want to go there. But this is what we need y'all to do. You know how... We need to implement the scissors, the, the emojis. Okay, the emojis. Hash to, go on King of the Sting... As well as their personal profiles. On Brendan Schaub's and Theo Von's And the Instagram. King of the Sting profile on Instagram. Sting. Okay. Leave a couple scissors. Hashtag scissor bros challenge. So we're we're putting a pin in the Whitney stuff for now and we're focusing we're on- gonna, We're going to, we're throwing a bunch of different curveballs everywhere. <laughs> we, we're the underdog here. You know, we're the nerd. <laughs> <laughs> we're, we're, okay. So- One of these schemes is going to work. So we need y'all- because they turned us down, man. I think the Ben Gay one turned them down. I mean, that was mild compared to the shock. I mean, and th this. This was hard today. That just is frustrating. 
that they turned it down. Hashtag on all of their social media, Scissor Bros Challenge. And this is the second thing that happened. You know, there's this nice kid. Uh, I wish I, I, forgot, I forgot his name. But he lost a, a bunch of weight. He was uh, overweight. He asked you a question the last time you were on the show. Yeah, right? he's yeah, a yeah. nice kid. I yeah, like the nice. kid. But, yeah. you know, the, he they, they, they played a video of him, like, punching a punching bag mm -hmm. and calling me out, like, I'm training for you, Stevie Weeby. How heavy is he now? He's a big boy. Okay. He's a big boy. Are you going to fight Up him? Up to the... Yeah, okay, so I'm going to get to that. Okay. So they want to do this, you know, wrestling kind of fighting scenario. And I go, there's no way. I mean, dude, I'm like a, a buck 35, a buck 40, if that. Yeah. You're probably, you're probably the same as me. <laughs> All but, right. All but right. They're, but they're saying you could tag in like a tag team. They brought you up again. Me? Yeah, like, you know, like a WWF type thing. Like like me and you versus this big guy? Yeah, but I, we could tag team in. We could, I could tag you in. Like tag team. Are they serious? I think, I mean, because they keep bringing it up every episode. You know. It's I'm, a reoccurring thing. You know I'm down, brother. So what we need to do is I want to get matching singlets. <laughs> like I want us to get like a real Like outfit. actual wrestling singlets. Yeah, like with scissors, <laughs> with scissors on them. We'll get shoes. <laughs> Maybe we'll get masks too. We'll, we'll get scissor bro masks. Like Rey, Rey Mysterio, like scissor, like masks? <laughs> yeah. <gasps> like those Mexican wrestling yeah. masks. Like, like the luchadors. fucking OG ones. The luchadors. Oh yeah, the luchador. Yeah. yeah. And then I think they'll I think they'll fund that. You know I'm down. Does this guy live in LA? No, they would have to fly him out. <laughs> <laughs> no, it would be an event. It would be an event. <laughs> if you're involved, I'll do it for you. If you're involved, I will be your but tag team But don't you think that would be really entertaining? It would be hilarious. Like to, It's like WWF. Oh, no, no. Because you, didn't you say those guys are into wrestling? Yeah. Like WWF. I think so. Yeah, yeah. Right? They, they're into MMA and stuff. I don't know if they're into to yeah, WWE Yeah, but this would be stuff. so entertaining. He's a nice kid. Okay, He's a well, nice kid. Let's do it. I mean, okay. Fly him out. And then I think they're going to get a whole ring or a... Oh, my goodness. Whatever. You know, we, we got to vlog that. Okay. We'll do We'll, we'll, we'll do ask. We'll, we'll ask. do it all. It's so a lot we, of exciting stuff then. Yeah. So just, you know, make sure you do Scissor Bros Challenge. Yeah. And then do we need another hashtag? I mean, just. Hashtag Scissor Bros Challenge is perfect. It's not too long, not too short. That's a great hashtag. Scissor Bros Challenge. Yeah. yeah. And they'll know. They'll the scissor know. emojis and all yeah. that stuff. Those we are the homies, you know. We, we, we love them. We appreciate that you guys follow through on these call to actions too. It makes we a do. difference. It's, it's dope. It's dope to have. Dude. Both of my shows, Sacramento and Portland. Didn't you just get back from ten Portland? Ten shows, back to back weekends, all sold out because of people like the Scissor Bros. So and they're Scissor coming out. Who are coming out to shows from Jeremiah Wonders, from Scissor Bros, just from stand up and other podcasts that I've done. I th so thank you guys very much and keep doing it. That's and, great. And if you miss the shows in Portland, I want to show uh, a few short highlights right now. What hat is that? What Christopher Columbus ass hat are you wearing? What the frick? This guy just settled in Portland, literally. You just, this guy didn't move here. He planted a flag here. Only in Portland do they have hats from the 1400s. They're like, this is Sunday here. <laughs> wow. There are some characters in this crowd tonight. <laughs> I don't even know if I'll have time to do any material. I just keep being, literally, my mouth, I keep having to, like, close shut. Because I'm just like, who are these people? Is this a costume party that I didn't know about? <laughs> it's a corporate event for a Halloween store, Jeremiah. We have a middle-aged relief pitcher right here. <laughs> New age Christopher Columbus. <laughs> you have a lot going on. You have a lot going on. He does. Even your girl, bucket hat, strong choices tonight. But I like it though. I like strong choices from people. Being like, I'm gonna make a statement tonight. And that statement is, you don't care about Native American people in that half. <laughs> yeah. Woo! 
Who wants blankets? Anybody want blankets, y'all? That's what that hat says. It's a little intense. Also, you guys can't see. Um, you broke your wrist or something? What did you do? His girl got attacked in a casino, so he punched a guy. Wow. <laughs> Bad luck. Um, what, what caused that guy to, like, how, how did that go down? I walked by him. And he just attacked you? Well, first he called me the C word. He called you the C word? Yeah. Cute? <laughs> What's up, cutie? Oh, hell no! Ah! That's my girl! Come on, let's go, bro! Ow, I broke my wrist! Ow! I like how you just Harry Potter magically changed your hat into a different shape. What is going on? He went from settler to Southern Belle immediately. <laughs> oh no, I like all people. Don't you worry about me. It's just Sunday in Portland, y'all. We just having a good time. Both of them, they know they need to nut up if they're gonna face the scissor pros. Everybody's thinking, whoa, are these two little guys calling them out? Yes, we are, cause we know that we're gonna go far. If it we're not putting strength to the test Because in that case, well they're the best But it's time to go head to head And they know that they'll feel dread When they lose against the scissor bros it's Cause they got no flow Unless you're talking periods Because they're just a couple pussies <laughs> Did I go too far? I called them pussies, I'm sorry I did, I, Brendan, I didn't mean to call you pussies But I, I just did I, I'm sorry. Was that too much, Steve? Thanks for tuning in YouTube.com Slash Scissor Bro Brendan, please don't hurt me, you're very strong We love them We love them Love all of them. But we're also ready to challenge them. Hashtag Scissor Bros Challenge today. Do some scissors. Here, do, do, do six more kisses. Okay, okay do, do, do more. Do one more. Do one more kiss. Oh.
what is this show? <laughs> My nipples are on fire. I feel good now. It keeps coming in and out for me. All right. Hot, hot, hot bath tonight. Hot bath. Hot shower tonight. Fun episode, though. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs>